Now to the opening arguments that could start today in the juvenile court judge Tracy Hunter's case. She's facing felony charges. She was now not before potential jurors actually claim slows down the process, I should say. Now your side reporter Mario Ramirez is following this case. He's here to sort it all out. What's the latest downtown, Mario? Well, right now, those prospective jurors are still being questioned to fill six alternate seats on the bench. But listen to this. One of them claims that he actually saw Tracy Hunter hugging another prospective juror when court let out here yesterday around 4 o'clock. But after the judge realized that that prospective juror couldn't point out exactly who it was, he dismissed the claim and proceeded on with jury selection. Judge Hunter is facing nine felony charges after being accused of using public funds to pay unauthorized filing fees and backdating court records to avoid appeals. Now, from what I've gathered, the goal of this jury selection is to find jurors who have no ties to juvenile court, as well as jurors who have not been following this case in the media. There has been an inordinate amount of publicity surrounding uh, the defendant in this case. Uh, have you been exposed to, heard, seen any of that publicity? Well, Hunter has pled not guilty to these nine felony charges. Opening arguments will start once those six alternate seats are filled here at the Hamilton County Courthouse. For now, reporting live downtown, Mario Ramirez, not on your side.